Oxygen. Seek and destroy. Oh. Hi there. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> I haven't seen you in... Oh, God, forever. How come you're around our house? Oh, you just got back. Oh, okay. Well, um... <laughs> I came here to find my sister. Do you know where she is? Well, I want to use her speaker to play some music that just dropped today. So even if she said no, I would have taken it. <laughs> All I have to do is like hold it high enough into the air so that she can't reach it. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, she's in the shower. Oh, well, I mean, that makes sense. It did get like really warm all of a sudden in this part of the country. Are you okay though? I mean, there's some ice cream, I think, in the freezer if you'd like some. Well, I mean, of course, you're a guest in our home. Also, you're not a bitch like my sister. <laughs> uh, all right, all right. I guess, I mean, yeah, that's probably just because she's my sister. But it's true, like, oh my god, like, always stealing my snacks, and always leaving me to do her chores, just because I'm the older sibling, like, oh my god. <sighs> She's going to be the worst person to live with if she ever moves out of this place. <clears throat> well, um, I found her speaker, so don't tell her I have it. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, it was nice seeing you, so bye-bye. Hey, um, sorry to bother you again, but, um, do you maybe want to come sit in my room? I know, like, she always takes a long time in there, so if you've got nothing else to do whilst you're waiting. Yeah? Alright, cool. Uh, just right this way, I guess. <laughs> <clears throat> Oh, and uh, make sure you shut the door behind you. Good. All right. Uh, you can sit in my chair if you'd like, or you can just sit on the bed, I guess. <laughs> so, how are you? Hmm. Well, that's good. You look so different now. I remember, like, you know, back in the day, you two would always buy, like, so many clothes and then bring them up to my sister's room. <laughs> oh, but, I mean, I have to say, that dress looks really, really fucking good on you. <laughs> and your hair as well. Mm. Puberty has been very, very kind to you, it looks like. <laughs> oh. So... I know my sister started university this year. Does that mean you did too? Hmm. I see. I bet your parents must have been so, so thrilled to find out you got accepted. <laughs> yeah, I know mine were. When my sister got her results, she was so excited she began packing, like, immediately. So... Oh, uh, I am actually on my final year now, so I have to finish this year, hopefully I graduate, and then it's time to find a job. So I'm actually quite excited about that, you know? I mean, university was like a really, really like weird experience. I mean, you know, I made some friends, and I met so many girls at like parties, and you know, kind of like freshers events every single year and I don't know I mean none of it really resulted in like a really really strong connection I mean you know some of them were nice went on some dates but I just really couldn't find someone I wanted to be with all the time you know so what's that um <laughs> Excuse me, <laughs> I know I have a scary face, but, well, you know, some ladies love it. <laughs> mm.
easy for you to say with your super approachable looking face. <laughs> uh, oh, you were scared of me as well. Wow, really? Even like all those years ago. Wow. I mean, I mean, I get it. Like, you know, <laughs> I'm your best friend's older brother, but I mean, my face is pretty, but also pretty scary. So, yeah. Did you know that, like, during, like, if I'm just, like, walking to, like, a lecture or something, and there are people that hand out, like, those cards or those flyers, they never handed them to me. Just probably because I look, like, really scary. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, it's great. Just nobody bothers me in the streets at all. I can just do whatever I want. So, suits my style, you know? I feel like it's not that, it's not, it's definitely not a curse, but it's not exactly a blessing either, you know, I mean, I don't know about you, but I feel quite happy just kind of being by myself currently, just gives me a lot of time to kind of focus on my hobbies and my interests, so, plus I've had jobs like locked down for most of my time at university, so I'm just trying to be independent and by myself <laughs> hmm. I'm sure it will be way different for you though <laughs> hmm. I've got a feeling you'll meet so many people once you're off to university <laughs> I'm being serious especially if you dress like this all the time <laughs> but that's casual Wow, damn, okay, <laughs> oh, wow, what kind of stuff do I do, um, well, I mean, okay, firstly, I'm sure you've noticed all the Metallica posters hanging up in here, <laughs> yeah, I mean, in my university city, like, metal clubs were much like just way more common than like R&B clubs or pop clubs and whatnot so my music tastes just kind of gradually slightly changed over the years um so I listen to a lot of music like that but I mean I draw sometimes and I write more often than I draw um uh <laughs> Well, uh, <laughs> how can I say this? Um, fiction, I guess. I write fiction. So, <laughs> you know, just like anything that comes to mind, you know? I don't really write like fully fleshed out stories, but it's a lot of fun to just kind of sit down for like an hour and a half, maybe two hours and just type out what I'm thinking about. So... Oh, actually, I have, um, like, a small folder with all of my drawings. Would you like to see them? Okay. Uh, I think it's in... Is it this one? Yeah, so... Let me just close this again. <clears throat> Alright, so, in fact, why don't you just, like, come and sit next to me so you can see. Closer than that, come on, don't you want to see my drawings? <laughs> uh, right, there you go. So, <clears throat> this was my first time, and I just decided to draw a black rose. No, nope. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know, I mean, I've always thought roses are pretty, but could you imagine a rose that's like, covered in like charcoal dust or like dipped in black ink yeah so I tried to make it look like the red was like dripping out here and then being replaced with the black so you know I thought it looked nice it did take a while though because I had absolutely no idea what I was doing <clears throat> mm. but 
I mean, I got better. So, I mean, if we look at this one, uh, this is meant to be uh, a woman wearing a wedding dress, just kind of staring out into the ocean. Yeah, I mean, oh my god, the moonlight was like so hard to get right because I had to learn how to properly, you know, mix colors and shade and, and you know, but I mean, I had to like draw some draft just so I knew what I wanted to do. And then I tried to draw this. So and then there's this one. I decided to draw some chocolate just kind of melting in the wrapper. Yeah, I mean. For some reason, I just started getting like cravings for chocolate. So like I would buy like a bar of chocolate every single week and then stop for like a couple months and then start again for another couple of months. It was so weird. I have no idea where it came from. But mm, so I tried to draw melting chocolate and there's a few other drawings, but they're the ones I'm like really proud of. So. Mm. What do you think? Do you like them? <laughs> mm, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> you know, this whole time, you've been so quiet and your cheeks are getting kind of red. Are you, are you okay? You're so cute, you know? <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> now that I'm this close, I can see your lips. And they look so soft. Mm. <sighs> Come here, darling. Mm. Thank God you shut the door. <laughs> mm. Oh, oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Did you just turn the shower turn off? Oh, okay. Uh, I think you need to go back. Oh, I know, I know. Mm. But you have to. Just make sure to say goodbye before you leave, okay?